Good morning, good afternoon, and a very good evening to you all, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Abe's Exodus. You are here with Morris. Ah, oh, that didn't work. Crap. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, I'm going to have to uh, maybe get on the platform that they're on. I know I said I wouldn't do this whole loading and reload and whatever, but there's when when you when there's parts that you know you can do, you just want to do them. <laughs> you want it done right. Yeah, this will be easier. You can actually cook grenades as well. That's a little uh, thing that I didn't realize for ages in this game. Why did he get up and say no? <laughs> That's never happened before. Okay, now I can possess it again. Don't worry. Yeah, because it's impossible to get those out if you don't possess these. Oh! I love how ruthless the Sligs are. I know, it really adds to their personality, I think. They're just willing to just... fill each other with lead if uh, somebody gets possessed. Okay, so these guys don't actually need to move, do they? But there's six to free in it. Okay then. <laughs> I see. I see where this is going. Okay, well let's get this guy out first because he's on his own. And we'll go off screen just to make sure he doesn't get killed. Yeah, that was easy enough. Alrighty. Now we gotta handle these. I don't understand why only some of them are depressed. It gives the impression that some of them are perfectly happy working here. That's fine. You know what? It's a living. I mean, all right, we don't get paid. Sure, sure. But you know what? It's it's. I'm doing some good work here. I can take pride in the work that I'm doing. Some of them are really just like, eh, I don't like this. Hey, what? And it just takes a simple sorry just to make them feel a little bit better. Hey, don't laugh at me. Oh god, this is gonna be crazy. Can I lead them across or not? That's the question. I'm gonna find out. <laughs> I don't know if they'll just open fire if they see him. Oh wow, they don't. Awesome. Important detail in this one is to make sure they're all in the middle part. Because those guys will fire. And there's a chance that they could get hit in the crossfire. Excellent! That's all six. To freedom! Should have pulled that lever before. Nice. Yeah, the thing to remember about these areas is you can't go back to them. So if you're gonna rescue the guys, you should probably do it right now. <laughs> Which makes sense, I don't know why you go back to these places. <laughs> oh man. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know what? A hundred billion slings? No, nope, not tough enough. These parts are actually, you can blow these things up and not take any damage. But it's very difficult, and I'm not even going to try and do it. But there are occasions where you can kind of glitch the game out a little bit. Ah, oh, crap! That's a long way to fall. <laughs> <sighs> I'm not as quick as I once was. Yeah, I, I was talking in the... I think it was last episode, but I was uh, talking about how... Sometimes you, uh, you look at... Whoa. Sometimes you look at your older games, and... You say to yourself, well, why did why did I ever play these, you know? Like, they're just badly... You, you realize that some games were just badly made. You know, you're more accepting as a kid because you really know that much about it. But, yeah, some games were just awful. But you played them anyway. Um, 
but you know, these ones, yeah, there's a real difference because this one is actually really solid. I mean, there are a couple, there are a couple of glitches and there are a couple of ways to manipulate stuff, as I've mentioned before, but largely this is a really solid, kind of well-designed game, I feel. Which is just another reason why you can just go back and play this, you know? Like, any time, really. I mean, Abe's Odyssey is the same. I don't want to take anything away from that, and that's where it started. <laughs> I don't trust myself with these bombs. Don't ignore me. Okay, now I don't know how this is going to work at all. I get him to follow me into the... Yep. Yeah. And through here. Thank Christ. <laughs> Okay, now I seem to remember. Occasionally there'll be uh, bird portals with numbers floating in them. And you have to rescue that amount, at least, inside that bird portal at any one time to get the. Uh, I think it's called sh Shrikel or Shriek Shriekel or something like that. And it's like a power which allows you to just basically beast everything on the screen. Which is awesome. And you get it in Age Odyssey first. But it makes a comeback here. Well, at least these follow all the same patterns, so that's okay. Look at this guy, he has to work between two mines. Two <laughs> easily deactivatable mines. I don't know what his problem is, really. Yeah, I think these are the only two we can rescue here. Doesn't look like we can get anyone else down here. Don't fall off the edge. Thank God. Sweet. But yeah, if you mess up the chance to get the power, then you kind of... Whoa! The notice board is fucked. Escapee's 11. <laughs> what the hell is that? That's never happened before. Yeah, there you go. This, just as I was talking about how well designed this game is. Great. Thanks, Abe. Good to know you're on my side. I don't even need to deactivate that, really. Ooh, is there a secret here? There is not. Don't know why I thought there was. Oh, wow. Oh, is there a secret here? Oh, no. There are some around here. I know there are. <laughs> I'm not crazy, I promise. Wow. Oh, there's a secret back there. That's why the mine's there. <laughs> oh, actually, yeah, we can just... Uh, we can possess this guy and blow it up. Can we shoot it? No. Ah, oh, come on! There we go. But yeah, I vaguely remember a secret here. Yeah, we go. Holy shit. Oh, yeah, I remember this one. Christ. This one's kind of tough. Just because it's, I mean, this this little bomb thing will probably indicate why it's tough. Oh crap, no, 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 whoa! There you go, there's the little manipulation tactic. As long as you're in the well, or in the animation that goes in the well, you can just blow up mines. There you go. I didn't even know that one myself. <laughs> Have I already fucked this up? I feel like I've already fucked. Oh no, we're okay, we're okay, we're good. Alright, let's see it. Whoa, 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 oh my god, that's gonna blow me up. Okay, good. Good! So we know it's timed. That's good news. Oh, I'm probably gonna have to wait for it to go around again, aren't I? You know the annoying thing about some of these screens is that they're more easily doable if you do them straight away. Like, the first time they load, you got to just go at it straight away and you can make it. And if you don't go at it straight away, you got to wait. you got to wait around like this. Boom, bash, bish. Turn around. Thank God. 
Oh, I got the secret. Oh my god, there's a thing there. Do I want to quick save it? Yeah. No! Oh god, it's a good job I did. <laughs> That's probably going to move towards them slowly, so we got to get down there as quickly as we can. So it's two steps to the right, and then we'll just jump. Boom. Bang. Yes, mate. That was easy enough. And that bomb's gone. Sweet. <laughs> Yeah, some of the animations apparently make you invincible. I think we'll back pocket that information. Only three left. Christ. God, how am I supposed to get rid of that bomb? What? <laughs> oh, maybe I forget on the other side. Hmm. An interesting conundrum we have here. That seemed right initially. Unless we can uh, do this. Ah ha ha. Sweet. Alright, you guys. Shut up. Alright, get in the middle. Always in the middle, guys. Come on. Get with the program. So I'm missing. Oh, Christ. Oh! <laughs> So there's a lot of information on this screen. Probably make that. Whoa, that was close. <clears throat> it's weird how the slicks don't shoot the employees who are clearly being led somewhere. <laughs> but I am glad about that information. Nice. Yeah, there we go. There's an example of uh, having to rescue three. And if you don't, then you're screwed. <laughs> Seriously, you'll see in the next screen now. I like how it has a warning symbol like, hey, please don't turn into this monster that can kill us all. If you wouldn't mind. But what's weird is there's no real introduction to this, uh, this power in this game. It's almost as if it assumes you played the first one, you know what it is. But that is so cool. I used to wonder what it was at first, but it's actually a combination, if you look closely, of a Paramite and a Scrab. It's like the ultimate creature. <laughs> but it also fires lightning. See, how are you supposed to do this screen without it? I guess maybe there might be a window to jump over those bombs, but eh. Yeah! I didn't see the frame rate drop that much actually. Normally it does. It does a lot on the screen anyway. Sweet! Yeah, I think uh, the designers assume a lot of the, uh, the audience for this game. You know, will have played. Will have played and be very familiar with the first one, so I don't need another explanation as to what that is. Oh man, now this, this is a friggin... This is a block right here, this is a puzzle. Um, get your pants. Get your pants here. I used to wonder what that is, but it's because of these little guys. Holy shit. <laughs> what do I need here? Get your wings, god. You can get anything around here. Crap. Crap. Nope, I don't want anybody to get the pants. 
Oh, thank God. Yeah, I think you have to get rid of those guys, don't you? I think we can unlock... Can we unlock this? What does this actually do? Alright, because I was wondering whether or not I would just deactivate one of those things rather than both of them. But that's alright. Okay, so this ground force for you. It's good douche. Sweet. Alrighty, well, I guess we'll open up A, whatever the hell <laughs> that is. And I will save it uh, and pause it for now, guys. But thank you very much for watching this episode of Abe's Exodus. And please do join me for the next part, guys. We are really going to take it to these slicks, it looks like. Uh, but yeah, I hope to see you there. I'll see you in a bit. See you later.